Hi you all, it's Kia Ray. Welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to come to you all with a quick video, really quick. Just to let you all know um, about my up and coming surgery that will be taking place next week on when Tuesday, not Wednesday, Tuesday. And also to just answer some questions. I'm getting a lot of questions asking about the procedure, what am I having done, and also how am I feeling about it. And I just want to share with you all. So as far as feelings and sentiments about the surgery, I'm feeling really good. I'm not going to tell a story. I'm very, very, very nervous. And nervous and kind of have a little anxiety about it. Um, it's just something that I, I can't control or, you know, can't predict the future so I don't know how it's gonna go I'm praying for the best I'm hoping for the best and not even that I don't think the surgery is gonna go out come out well it's just you know anytime you go under anesthesia you're taking a risk and surgery is just nerve-wracking period but on the other hand I'm also very excited just to see the outcome and have a mixed feeling towards it now I am a little iffy about dilation afterwards because as you all know from my previous videos me and dilation we don't we don't we just don't click <laughs> it just has never been a thing that you know worked out for me but this is something that I'm gonna have to do and I knew this going in that after I have my surgery dilation is a must in order to continue to stretch my length um so that's something I'm definitely not looking forward to because as I've said many times, I hate dilation. Like, it just sucks. But I was told that I will be getting new dilators. So maybe since they're not going to be the glass dilators again, it can go better. And also the fact that I'm going to actually have something to dilate now. Because last time I didn't have anything. I was like hitting a wall. So I'm actually going to have a vaginal canal. And therefore, I will be actually penetrating. And maybe that will be different. So I'm a little nervous about that. And excited at the same time, like I said. It's mixed emotions. I want to thank everyone who has reached out to me and just checked on me in, in these up and coming weeks. And especially my Amber Cage sisters because... You all, especially the ones that have already had the surgery, you all are amazing um, with your stories, your testimonies, and just um, telling me that it's going to be okay. And it's like, this is normal. Everyone's going to have these jitters before surgery. So I'm really excited to have you all to reach out to. And even just after, like post-surgery, to be able to contact you all and see if, you know, I can do anything better or how can I do certain things? So I'm very grateful for you all. And thank you all for checking on me. You all continue to check on me. And I love that. So the surgery that I will be having is called the Lyphroscopic Davy Doe um, Vaginal Procedure. Because I'm doing it with the Miklis and Moore um, Surgical Group in Atlanta, Georgia. And on I arrive on Sunday. And I have my first consult where I'll be able to meet with the surgeons and talk with them, ask them any questions, and just get to know them for a moment and get to know more in detail about my surgery. Right now, I only know like what I've read. Of course, I have some questions prepared for them. So I'm really excited to do that. And after Monday, after I have my consult, I will be going into surgery on Tuesday. And that's pretty much it. Tuesday is going to be a life-changing day for me. Tuesday, November 20th. It's, it's going to be an experience. I'm very, like I said, I have mixed emotions about it. I don't really know how to feel about it yet. I'm sure once I'm there in the action, it'll be totally different. But no worries. I'm going to take you all along with me every step of the way. I have already made preparations to vlog it, and I'm very excited. So I'm going to leave some images 
um, at the end of this video just explaining my surgery. I got these images actually off of my surgical group's website. So they are very detailed. I think one of them is an actual live image. They're um, animated images. I think one of them is actual live image. So if you have a weak stomach, I would advise not to look at it. But also, I'm going to leave a link below in the description box. In that link, you can go to the YouTube video of the actual procedure um, being done. Um, my surgical group has a YouTube video as well, just discussing the procedure, the benefits of it, and also just showing in like complete detail. Because I am having the procedure and I understand it, but I can't really explain it to you all. And that's something that I wanted to do, but honestly, I can't really explain it like thoroughly the way that they can. So if you go to the YouTube video, which is going to be in the link below, it just breaks all the way down. It actually takes you through the actual surgery, and that's really cool. That's how I looked at it, and that's how I learned about it. So definitely go check that out if you want to learn more. And just continue to keep me in your prayers, you all. Thank you all so much for all the support and love that you already give me. But continue to lift me up. Keep me in your prayers. Like I said, I have mixed emotions. I'm pretty sure on the day of, I'm going to be just crazy emotional and I'm just excited I'm excited to see what the future holds I'm excited to see my lifestyle modification with this surgery um but I don't know what it's gonna be and I think that's the biggest thing with me not knowing I am um, very I'm like a control freak so I love to know like what's coming next and honestly I don't know I don't know what's coming next and it kind of scares me but at the same time it's needed <laughs> so i'm looking forward to it and again i can't thank you all enough for just coming along with me on this journey so yeah like i said it's gonna be short i made a promise so that's all um like i said i will be taking you all on the journey so my next video will probably be after my surgery but it will be of my you know process with getting there and the actual surgery showing you all after like post-surgery so I'm, gonna, I'm trying to make these vlogs as real as I possibly can because, like I said, I'm taking you all along on the journey. So um, check out these images at the end of the video. And if you all have any questions that you want to ask, uh, want, would like me to ask my surgeons, just drop them below. Or you can email me or you can hit me up on um, Instagram if you like. Thank you all so much for watching my little short video and I'll see you all after surgery.